This video serves as an introduction to DNA viruses. These viruses are sometimes referred to as herpes viruses. Herpes for herpes virus, hepadna virus, adenovirus, papilloma virus, parvovirus, pox virus, and polyoma virus. Right, so the DNA viruses, uh, they have general characteristics with few exceptions, right? For example, most DNA viruses are double-stranded, except parvovirus, which is actually single-stranded, right? And if you know your Latin, parvus means small, so it's a small virus, right? And uh, it's single-stranded. Most of the DNA viruses have linear genomes, except papilloma and polyoma. So these two are secular and supercoiled. Not forgetting the hepadna virus, right? So this one is secular and incomplete. Above that, most DNA viruses have an icosahedral symmetry. Uh, except the pox, right? So the pox virus is actually complex, right? Um, and its structural proteins, uh, it looks like a box, right? So you can remember, like, pox in a box. Pox in a box, right? Uh, and, and the last thing is, most of the DNA viruses replicate in the nucleus. And the exception, again, is pox right so pox virus actually uh carry their own dna dependent rna polymerase right so they replicate in the cytoplasm uh you can remember this by saying pox out of the box now in this case pox out of the box you are talking about the box nucleus right so out of the box out of the nucleus right and here, this box, we are talking about the capsid, right? Box in a box, right? So it's the structure of the, of the capsid, which, look, which is complex and it looks like a box, right? Okay, I have um, mnemonics for you. I, I will tell you how to remember these uh, features, right? Let's move on. All right, so here is a basic classification of the DNA viruses, right? So uh, they can be enveloped or naked, right? Let's start with the enveloped viruses, right? Uh, all enveloped DNA viruses are double-stranded, right? And in terms of symmetry, we have icosahedral and complex, right? Complex we actually have one pox, pox in a box, right? Uh, on icosahedral, we have herpes virus, right? And hepadna virus, right? Let's move to a naked DNA viruses, right? Here, uh, we have double-stranded and single-stranded, right? And here on single-stranded naked DNA virus, we only have one, the parvovirus, which is icosahedral, right? Uh, then a double-stranded with icosahedral symmetry. Here we have a uh, papova, right? Papova is papilloma and the adeno, right? How to remember all these features? Okay, I have a uh, not-so-dating mnemonic for you, right? Firstly, a woman must be naked, for the pap smear test or pap smear exam, right? Do you know the pap test, right? This one is uh, a, a test for cervical cancer in women, right? As you can see here, I'm sure you will remember it. So pap will help you to remember papilloma virus, adenovirus, parvovirus, and polyoma virus, right? So these viruses are naked, right? But why should you know only about naked things. You should also remember that enveloped DNA viruses have helpful protection, right? 
especially when it's snowing. Right, so this will help you to remember herpes virus, hepadna virus, and pox virus.